हेलो माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू माई कंप्यूटर साइंस क्लास स्टूडेंट्स टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद द न्यू चैप्टर फॉर्मेटिंग वर्कशीट्स इन एम एस एक्सेल दिस इज सिक्स चैप्टर ऑफ योर क्लास सिक्स कंप्यूटर साइंस बुक आई टी प्लानट इन दिफ्थ चैप्टर वी हैव स्टडीड अबाउट इंट्रोडक्शन टू एम एस एक्सेल इन विच वी स्टडीड फ्यू ऑफ द फीचर्स ऑफ एम एस एक्सेल इन दिस पार्ट वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट द फॉर्मेटिंग so what is formatting it is a very important feature in excel and it helps you to make your worksheet more attractive and uh, organize that worksheet according to your requirement so this formatting improves the appearance of your worksheet like you can change the writing style which is the font the size of the writing style you can add colors to your um, tables in excel so first is changing the font so let us do some practical work so the first feature is changing the font of data so i have created a table a short small table and i want to change the font of the data so i will select the cell or cells whatever you, you can select a whole column a single cell a whole row or a complete table also and change the font the font is in the home tab so you have to click on the home tab this is the writing style or font style so it is calibri i want to change to some other writing style so there these are the different writing styles you can choose out from all these different writing styles so i am choosing some different writing style i want to choose georgia pure black now i want to increase the font so this is the font size this is the font style this is the font size i want that my heading should be larger so in this way i can increase the font size you can increase or decrease the font size from here also this means increasing the size and this is for reducing the size now what is there um, you have to adjust the cell this i have told you in my, the previous chapter you can adjust the column width and row height so i am changing the column width there another way there is another way to change the column width or to adjust is uh, adjust it according to the written matter like here it is keyboard and you you have, you have to click here and double click quickly automatically the column width changes to required width now you can i can select it like this also and then i will select georgia and this one so in this way i can change the size font size and font style now next is making it bold italic and underlined so in this you will not be able to Uh, identify what is bold so i am cha again changing the writing style to times new roman or any common writing style so calibri and this is the font size 14 now i want to make the headings look bolder or darker so i will choose these are the different forms like bold b is for bold i is for italics and u is for underlined so i am making it bold underlined also uh, italics also and, and and because they are heading i want to underline them also so underlined you can see now it is underlined also so this was this is also in the home tab all these features these fonts are in the home tab now there are some shortcut keys also for making bold italics or underline and are very very simple if you want to make this bold you will just press control and b this is the keyboard shortcut for bold 
for italics it is control plus i and for underlined control plus u so it has become underlined so these are the keyboard shortcuts now changing the alignment of data what is alignment uh, if you are writing a paragraph here not a paragraph because it is excel if you want that the text inside the cell should be towards it should start from the right side uh, the extreme left it should appear from extreme left or extreme right or in the center of the cell then you have to align the data so next feature is changing the alignment of data so for that like uh, i want these cells because they are heading i want these are left aligned you can see that uh, the words that are written are towards the left of the cell so i want that it should be in the center so i will click on this now it is center aligned and here, this is for right align if i click on it now it is right aligned there towards the the written text is towards the right side and this is left alignment so i am making it center aligned i am making it left aligned and the values i want them also to be center aligned there is one more thing suppose i want to write a heading sale of computer parts i have written the heading but i want it should be at the center of all this this table so what i can do i will select the cells the columns which i i have utilized for making the table then i will click on this merge and center so all the cells that i have selected will be merged and the text will be at the center i can change the writing style i can change the size also because it is the heading i can make it bold italics if you wish you can make it italic also so this was about merge and center now the next feature that i'm going to show you is the how can we change the color of the cell so like this if i want to color the cell with yellow or any other color this is the fill color box select it 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 becomes yellow i can select the whole color and it is now the cell has become colored this is fill color option i am using the fill color, color option and all these are in the home tab i am showing all the features which is using the home tab i want this row because it is the heading to be in a different color so i am choosing blue color i have, i want all the data to be gray in color so in this way we can change the color of the cell i can change the color of data also whatever i have written i want to change the color i want this text to appear in red so i will click on this icon on the home tab this is font color so you can see the color of the font has changed i want this font to be in purple so now it is purple in color so this is fill color option to fill the to change the color of cell and this is this option is for changing the color of text now i have created a table i have given a heading i have 
चेंज द कलर बट स्टिल द टेबल इज नॉट वेरी क्लियर टू मी बिकॉज देर आर नो बॉर्डर्स द बॉर्डर्स आर लिटिल मिक्स आई वॉन्ट क्लियर कट बॉर्डर सो वॉट कैन आई डू आई विल सिलेक्ट द टेबल एंड दिस इज द ऑप्शन द बॉर्डर्स नाउ यू कैन चूज अ नंबर ऑफ बॉर्डर्स लाइक ऑल बॉर्डर्स ऑल द बॉर्डर्स विल अपियर आई कैन चूज thick borders also thick outside border so a thick outside border will appear outside just the outside border becomes thicker in width so there are number of options like uh, only right borders will appear only left borders will appear so you can try all these borders with different and you can see the change in appearance so students this was about the general formatting of uh, your excel table in the next part i'll tell you some new new uh, some more features in formatting so till then students thank you